Too much protein can make your blood sugar worse. Nobody's talking about this. Here's the truth. You don't need a high protein diet to reverse insulin resistance. In fact, too much protein, especially from animal foods, can make things worse. When we teach people how to eat, we focus on low fat, plant-based, whole foods. And here's the crazy part. When you do that, your body actually becomes more insulin sensitive. So your blood sugar starts stabilizing even without chasing more protein. Think of it like this. Your cells are like lock. Insulin is the key. When there's too much fat stored inside your muscle and liver cells, the lock gets jammed. Adding more protein doesn't fix the lock. It doesn't fix the root problem. But lowering fat and eating plants actually cleans the lock so the key can churn smoothly again. Here's the best part. All whole plant foods contain protein. If you're eating enough calories from fruits, vegetables, beans, and grains, you're naturally hitting your protein needs. You don't need to stress about this at all. And you'd be fueling your body with the exact foods that improve insulin sensitivity. So don't fall for the high protein hype. If your goal is reversing insulin resistance, put your focus on lowering fat and eating whole plant foods. The protein will take care of itself. Comment the word training and we will send you a free video training I just recorded on how to reverse insulin resistance so you can improve your A1C and lower your fasting blood sugar levels permanently.